Welcome back to another episode of BPL TV. I'm Micah Gibbs. And I'm Liam Mucklow. And today we're going to talk to you about how to screen the foot. And when you have an athlete that fails ankle mobility tests, this is the next place that you should go. So let's take a quick look here just as a brief reminder about how we screen the ankles and what we're looking for. Yeah, it, so talk us through this. Yeah, here. so we have a player here that he's worked on his ankle mobility a ton. And when we're looking at it, we can see there is a little bit of uh, some instability in the or some some lack of mobility in the right foot, but the right. left foot's pretty pretty clean. So anytime we get a player that struggles with any of the ankle screens, we want to take them a little further down into the foot. Yeah. So. So let's see, Micah, talk to us about how these foot stability, ankle mobility issues manifest themselves in some common swing faults. Yep. So here's one that we see a ton, especially with youth players, is where they lose space. Mm -hmm. uh, so this is a characteristic when you can draw a line behind the hitter's butt. You can just basically see, is he, is he going to stay on that line or is he going to come towards the plate too much? When we have bad foot stability or ankle mobility, we're going to see this a lot. Okay. Well, let's let's take a look at one more here. Yeah. So in this one here, uh, we're gonna see, and we see this in both videos actually, is that decrease in vertical force happens right away, uh, right as soon as they start that positive move. And you can see here the instability creates him to lunge, and therefore it's gonna be really difficult to create any kind of adjustability from pitch to pitch. All right. Well, some pretty simple action items today. You gotta screen the ankles, and if there's a fail there, really simple. Just put them through yoga toes and. Uh, help your hitters, you know, just get better. Right.